So, in this video I will go through the main features of the Edge Pro user interface. The user interface of the Edge Pro consists of three different sections. Starting from the top here, we have the main view. And for the main view, you can change between the different view options. An example for this free view, you can change your viewing angle freely. Right here, you have the zoom in and zoom out. And uh, in the left here, you have uh, up and down buttons for uh, quickly changing between the different models. In the center here, you have the profile view, which is showing the budget view from the left and the budget view from the front. You also have a budget arrow indicators for the left and for the right budget measuring point. And in the center here, we have an indicator for annual difference between the budget and the model. Down here, we have the dashboard, which shows the different measuring modes. And uh, example in this case, we have the height from the model, which is currently 61 centimeters. You can also change between the different dashboards by swiping to the left and to the right. And you can also change between the different profile views by swiping to the left and to the right. Down here, we have the left and right menu buttons. And uh, example in, in the left menu, we have uh, more attachment and feature related settings. Example in here, we have the feed buttons on and off. So if I tap here, then the feed button is appearing to the right side of the dashboard. In the right menu, we have more project related settings and information. Example, we can see the name of the project, the name of the model, and we can modify our starting level as well. And uh, both of these menus, left and the right one, they are changing depending on the project type and also the attachments that, that, are, that are installed to that machine. So that was the short introduction to the user interface of the Edge Pro.